Let's see if we can get Traylon Burks off and running here. Highly anticipated 40. I'm going to go 448. Here's my. There he goes. 455. During the commercial break was Alec Pierce as soon as we went to break from Cincinnati. Boom. And that's not a surprise. 4 3 3. He's a strong, powerful runner who runs away from everybody when you watch him on tape. Great game against Notre Dame. Yeah, he was one of my he was my glue guy after beating Notre Dame. Nice. Yeah, look, if you beat Notre Dame or Ohio State this year, get, it was he had some glue money. Yeah. Valus Jones Jr. He's got he's got some Debo skills four, and he, three, can, four. he can scoot. He's nice. somebody that you can use at running back in the I thought Danny Gray kind of grabbed a little bit at the end of his 40. Still ran low four threes. Right. <laughs> Look four at three, this. Four. For, uh, didn't he already propose to us? He's got a child. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Sorry. Sorry. He's <laughs> taken. He's taken. He's taken. Sorry. Young Layton, uh, if you're watching, go back to bed. <laughs> Chris Olave. <laughs> four, two, six people. Okay. <laughs> He's like, I've seen that before. Yeah. Hey now. Four, two, six. He's like, I hope you enjoyed the first group of wide receivers. Four of them did, in fact, officially run sub four, four, but that's the first sub four, three that we've seen here. Tyquan Thornton of Baylor. These times are unofficial. However, if it's official, <laughs> we have a new fastest man in the history of the combine. I thought he stumbled. That is one one hundredth of a second faster than John Ross's time in 2017. And it was in Detroit where Randall Elf threw a touchdown pass in Super Bowl 40. Played his college football not far from here in, in India. Calvin Austin. Smooth. Eisen's the only one who doesn't like this drill. I do not like it. Here's Burks. Burks. Get moving. He got some big old hands, you guys. And confidence in catching the ball. You'll see the receivers get comfortable or uncomfortable. This, right this kid has great hands on tape, you guys. Jahan Dotson from Penn State. Mm. That looked confident. That I did. Yeah, you see what I'm saying? <laughs> Once you go. It's a strong throw. Trying to see if anyone's got a dominant hand. Like, I like what my right hand is on top when I'm catching the pass. It's a little more. I had to work a little bit more when I put my left hand on top. Yeah. I. <clears throat> What? Please, for the love of God, can we get Michael Irvin a shirt that fits? You know? So hopefully you have better luck with your linebacker. I think he's wearing your shirt right now, Gio, personally. Right. How technically sound these young men are, right? You can see the speed. When it, when they, when these receivers get to put their foot in the ground and just... It's impossible, but at least I will back that corner up. If you're breaking down at eight routes, that corner's not moving too much. He's going to sit. Those are little things. Deep corner route. Want a seven step, try to one hitch it. So you extend your drop a little bit. But a big part of this is, as we keep talking about, is right. I need my receiver to really push Sell into post. the post. Yeah. So we've post. got room on the side. And to be patient, be yeah. that patient. Steve, you be, you, you be I got to get out of this route. I got to get out of this route. He's ready to throw it. To be that patient at a young age, very difficult too. to teach. Yes. Right. Let's give him some time to develop. He's got something to work with. Look, Kurt, look at Howell right here and tell me if you see some of the things I saw when I Not bust the seams. <laughs> hey, come on, man. I can't help it. I got this Hulk muscle thing. That's why. And, um, you know, the interesting thing, though, is the gloves that I wore were the old school leather gloves. You know, watching Kenny Pickett looks like he's got more of the Teddy right? Bridgewater. I know about T. Higgins. He did take somebody's job up in Cincinnati, too. I call it how I see it. Well, what do you think of these kids then, Steve? Oh, these kids are going to take a whole bunch of grown men's jobs. They, we've been out here and watched some of these quarterbacks, Steve, and Kurt put some heat in this drill. I remember Steve going up to some and saying, hey, man, here's from take Buffalo. Some, <laughs> take, some of these take some of that off the ball in these drills. But these guys here, I mean, they've been giving nice balls to catch. Well, some of it, too, is, you know, quarterbacks – some of the quarterbacks are not understanding yeah, which nice drills are there. for the quarterback and which drill for the wide receiver. They're all for quarterbacks. Yes. Who are you kidding? Right. Nice. <laughs> Everything. Everything <laughs> I do out here, I'm, I'm trying to impress somebody. I understand. I understand your point, but 
I, I'm just saying that there us. are some drills that are primarily quarterbacks are being well, right. examined and under the microscope, and then there are drills that the wide receivers are right. being. No, in under. all in all seriousness, is is are the quarterback throws like again? If somebody's looking at, at Willis right now, are they? Like, we don't even have it in the playbook anymore. You know, so many of these guys are so used to catching. That was unbelievable. And Cop and him had such an, a, con a connection this year. And the neat part about it is we watch Alec Pierce go through this is we, none of us when we're sitting here watching. Of throwing it with his body and being able to put the touch on it that he needs. And uh, that's why these kind of throws, <laughs> they're hard for guys. Sales. Well, now I've just said it when I when I played is you very seldom want to throw the ball as hard as you have to. Irv is giving out advice to some of the wideouts right out there. We're on, we're on the struggle bus a little bit. That's Christian Watson. All right, let's see Pickett throw this one here. <laughs> it's a tight ball. Oh, it's a great nice ball. Just right grab now. two. That was Wilson. One was it Garrett Wilson? Yes, it was. Back of a catch. Your number six overall player in the draft, Garrett Wilson. Oh. However, it can be at your disadvantage when you can't run that full speed route all the time. Strong with a nice was perfect. Deep ball there to Olave. Touchdown. Fans like it. So it makes it easy for him to be identified out there. I appreciate that. Nice grab. Yeah. Still waiting on the official 40s. By the way, it's Garrett Wilson. <laughs>